Thank you for calling opensource.com. Community moderator Ben Cotton speaking. Oh, hey, how's it going? Yeah, can you believe they said I phoned in last week's top five video? Yeah, well, I know how I'd do it if I were taking a look at the top five articles for the week ending February 23rd, 2018. Uh-huh. Yeah, number five would be Pearl Hashes and Arrays, The Basics. Did you read that? Community moderator Ruth Holloway gets back to basics with an introduction to two important parts of Pearl. Yeah, if you're interested in getting started with Pearl, you need to read this article. Yeah, and you were talking about looking for a new job, right? Yeah, you should read How Linux Became My Job. Phil Estes tells the tale of how he took his hobby and went pro with it. May we all be so lucky. Okay, I, I know I'm giving you a lot of articles. Um, maybe you could create a wiki on your Linux desktop with Zim to keep track of the articles. Community moderator Scott Nesbitt show, will show you how it's done with Zim. Yeah, it's a good article. Oh, and hey, um, if you need to learn some things for that new job, a SUNY math professor makes the case for free and open educational resources. Yeah, I mean, you know, disruption in school will usually get you sent to the principal's office, but uh, community moderator Don Watkins tells us how open educational resources are making a good disruption. Yeah. Oh, oh, one more thing before I go. Did you hear how the Grateful Dead were a precursor to Creative Commons licensing? Yeah, the Grateful Dead didn't just make music, they made it so people could share music. Matthew Helmke connects the dots from the Dead to Creative Commons. Okay, right, yeah. Well, I mean, you know, what a long, strange trip it's been. I should let you go. I'll just sit here and read the other great articles on opensource.com.